Every hour, six women are killed by their husbands, boyfriends, or family members. That is according to new research published by the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime. This week, a grand jury indicted four local men for murdering someone they were supposed to care for. Action News Jack's Jenna Bourne breaks down each high profile case. Two months before Marvin Williams was accused of killing his girlfriend, he posted this on Facebook. My beautiful soon-to-be wife, I love you now and forevermore, and there's no other woman that can ever take your place. In the years before Cassandra Valentin was found stabbed to death here in her Moncrief home, court records show she had already accused her boyfriend of showing up here with a knife, raping her and beating her more than once. My son over there, he went to school with her and he told her, said that going to kill you. You need to let him go. And she said, I'm lonesome. 58% of women killed worldwide in 2017 died at the hands of someone they loved, according to newly published research. We learned this week Williams and three other men were indicted for first degree murder for killing women, or in one case, a girl they were supposed to care for. Chad Absher is accused of fatally shooting his girlfriend, Ashley Rucker. Her sister, Lisa Rucker, was also shot but survived. I wish that he could be killed the same way he killed my sister and tried to kill me, honestly, but that's that never going to happen. Gerard Stewart is accused of stabbing his wife, Julie Ann Stewart, and hiding her body in the trunk of his car. And Brandon Smith was indicted, accused of beating two-year-old Elena Williamson to death. She was his girlfriend's daughter. Reporting in Moncrief, Jenna Bourne, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News, Jax.